So we're going to talk about the Dead Air Silencer's key micro adapter. You see here on my PSA AKV. So this uh, is coming about because I've got some questions of uh, some of the viewers asking if I actually have mounts for everything you've seen me put this Dead Air Ghost 45 can on. And so the answer is yes. Everything that you've seen me mounted on I actually have the mounts, they're functional. I've had people just ask if I'm just threading them on or if they actually will work. So, yes, I have several different mounts. Um, Dead or Ghost offers quite a few different options. Um, we'll go over those here in the next few videos. But today we're going to talk about the key micro adapter. And you'll see on once the adapter is put on your Dead Air Ghost, there is one indexing point, one mark. So it'll only go on one way if you rotate that it will not go on until you hit that point once it's on that simple it's a nice option it's good solid lockup and just as easy to take off so we'll talk about we'll break down the components what makes the system work okay as you can see here this is the key micro this is a half by 28 mount and this is on the PSA AKV this one has to be timed because as you can see here yeah there are some exhaust ports uh, just shim it time it and then uh, the key micro mount on your dead air silencer will interface with this and I'll show you that next okay on your dead air silencer 45 and this is also work with the Wolfman this is the key micro adapter that will line up with this key micro muzzle device so we'll show you that how it interfaces and then how this comes apart okay once you have this is how your key micro adapter will arrive and this is the Dead Air Ghost 45M. You can see on the back side, this would be the side facing the gun. That part is threaded and will accept this mount. And then several of the others we'll talk about. I just wanted to show you this mount here. And that is the key micro adapter for the 45M, the Ghost. 45 and the Wolfman. Okay, well, as I showed you there. So once you have your 45M uh, attachments off of there, whatever it usually comes with the, the booster, your key micro adapter will just thread in as such. And then this is the one of the dead air wrenches. This is the TL1. So what I like to do is I'll just let's see if I can get it in camera here. All right, and I'll just give it a twist, nice and tight. So now the adapter. You see, this is the ratcheting part. This is what tightens the taper up when it's on the on the adapter or on the muzzle brake so in the instructions it tells you uh, they'll show you how to oil it and then to run it a little bit when it's new I tell you what these it is it is very tight the teeth lock up really good the ratcheting part so when it's new um, to work it I don't know it's 10 times or so I found I've done it more so that's how you attach that to the Dead Air Ghost. The micro, uh, key micro adapter. And then again, this tool here is the TL1 accessory wrench from Dead Air Ghost. Or Dead, Dead Air Ghost, from Dead Air Silencers, pardon, sorry. Short video on the Dead Air Silencers key micro adapter. 
We'll talk about more coming up. Uh, please like and subscribe, share the videos. Kind of helps me out. We're looking for some new sponsors, trying to get the name back out. We're coming back with videos. We took a little break, and we're we're just trying to build back up. So got a lot of stuff to show you. Watch for the next one. Thanks again, and be safe.